Um, Greg, talk about the uh, transition from the 400 to the the 100 and 200. What how'd that come about, and how's that working out so far? Well, it's been a pretty natural transition as uh, for years I've been running a leg on our 4 by one relays over the summer and uh, especially this past year I was running second leg and our relay broke the 15-16 national record so we just kind of wanted to see, alright, let's see where this sprinting can kind of go and so we can take the time to focus and uh, work on the technical aspects of that and all the things that have to do with sprinting, strength and such as we move forward. Uh, you, this. Uh summer uh track what's your who's your track team what are you on i run for hallmark track club we're out of fort worth i see um other teammates here from other schools on that relay that set the record well one of them goes here jalen robinson he's a he's a uh, highly touted football recruit out of here mm -hmm. and then we have uh Keyshawn everly he goes to fort worth trimble tech he was our anchor leg and then we have asante fazaro out of allen texas he goes to allen high school and he was our third leg. Of the um, how? Uh, um, what's the different? What's the biggest difference in your mind, or physically, uh, in the 200 and 100 compared to the 400? It's so much more. I guess the word would be aggressive and ex explosive. It's just it's so much faster and over quicker. In the 400, you're going fast, but it's it's still you're just kind of pushing your way all the way around the track. In the 100, it's just. You start and you're over, and it's pretty quick and technical. So, um, in the uh, 400, I would guess there's uh, some amount of a kick in the last 100 meters or so, but I guess in the other two, it's just all out. It's just you're going the whole time, pretty much. Yeah. Uh, um, is it? Uh, uh, and talk about your best time so far in the 100 and 200 this year. In the 100, I've gone 10.60. In the 200, I've gone 21.24. Uh, the 21-24 puts me, I think, top four in the state, and then the 10-6 puts me top 20 in the state. How much lower can you go? <laughs> That's what we're trying to find out. Uh, uh, I think... You set a goal? I mean, 10-5, 10-4, anything like that? 10-5 or below would be pretty would be pretty nice in the 100. And then if I could get, if I could somehow make my way under 21, that'd be pretty fantastic.